we um, at Temple University feel very similarly about the important anchor role that our institution plays for our surrounding community and in engaging with high school students in Philadelphia. So I've always considered it to be a tremendous privilege to be able to invite students on campus. And one of the things that's been um, a very stark change for us in you know, our response to COVID is that bringing students onto campus in person has been, uh, you know, we've been unable to do that during the last two years. We found that in the past year, our students gained a tremendous amount of self-efficacy compared to the prior year with the use of digital skills. And I suppose a year of hybrid and, and at-home learning has really helped them to understand the ins and outs. And what we found this year is that we were just really able to take off with our students and reimagine how they would learn. You know, when you talk about um, preparing young people to, to succeed in tomorrow, in the, the future, right? And so you're talking about in a, almost an academic setting and learning and being able to really apply that in your home, which is incredible. We're doing the same from tomorrow's individuals in the workforce. So as you know, we are both sitting in our homes, right? <laughs> and we're working and we're doing work. And so this program really shows them, here's how you work in your home and in a professional manner. This is how you um, gain career development, how you get exposure to the workplace, how do you accept and receive feedback? I mean, it was really interesting. I actually personally had a PYN intern on my team and she was on our calls. And so we you know, asked her, what do you think? You're our future. You know, we really want to hear what you have to say. You, you know, you we have confidence because you know, one of my responsibilities is early career talent hiring. So you're, you're the, the audience I want to understand. Is this cool? <laughs> and I was told, no, that's not cool, <laughs> which is really, which is just awesome. And so, um, you know, giving the students that opportunity to get that exposure in high school and whether they go on to college or not, or go right into the workplace in today, they were actually in a real life example of what the future would be like for them. And so it prepares them. It was just, just really, really incredible. We look at critically, how is technology shaping the lives of the students with whom we work? And one of the things that we found um, in our program last year was that it was, a, it was a, just a set of wild paradoxes that, that they were facing. You know, technology is all around them. They have cell phones and so forth. Mm -hmm. And yet they hadn't really figured out how they were going to be working from home because it was all too new. They didn't necessarily have a desk set up that was going to be the base for where they were going to do their work for the program. They weren't sure how they were going to engage with teams because it was all too new. And we have the same problem with the students who are the staff for this program. Our program involves uh, Temple University students to provide the mentorship of the high school students who are in the program. And so we were simultaneously retraining our own students how to deal with the virtual environment while they in turn were working with the high school interns that are part of the PYN program. And so we sort of found ourselves asking all kinds of questions like, you know, cell phones help us to be connected and yet we felt like our students were too isolated and sought many ways to try to break that isolation isolation, you know, in a time of COVID. 